Welcome to my channel, Living Linux. Today I will show you how to export a slide in LibreOffice Impress as an image. I was working on a project, a 4K video, and I wanted to have a slide as an image in the 4K video. And of course, you can always scale the image but what I wanted to do is just have it from the source already in 4K. So you don't have to rely on the scaling capabilities of other software. I have a Windows laptop with a 4K screen, but I had some problems to do a screen grab of a 4K slide. And that's when I started to investigate if it is possible to export your slide directly from LibreOffice Impress. And that is actually possible. So I'm preparing a very simple slide here. And I'm going to add Tux, the mascot. And I personally like this one. And it's free to use. And I think the only thing you have to do is attribute it. So in this case, some person with the name or alias Maxo based this already on something else. So thank you to Maxo. And this is a SVG file, Structured Vector Graphics. And I already downloaded it. And the advantage of SVG is that it's, when it's created properly, it should scale very nicely to any size you want. So in this case, going back to LibreOffice Impress, I say I want to insert the image. And here is the SVG file. And with, with the Alt key and the arrow keys, you can move it around a bit. So let's just say a bit like this. And now here comes the trick with exporting. So in this case, I'm going to choose PNG, Portable Network Graphic. And when you click on save, you can play around with the resolution. So in this case, let's just say we'll go for 120 pixels per centimeter. It doesn't really matter that much, but with 120, it's really nice to um, have the, it's a nice number to calculate, let's just say for full HD or 4k so for full hd you can just use 9 but when you want to have 4k then you can go with the height 18 and then the width accordingly goes to 32. and well you can also do interlaced or save transparency but in this case that's yeah, not really that relevant and now it has been exported as a 4K image. So when we go here, it's all looking nice and sharp. And let's just say when we say, oh, that's not what I wanted. How do we know it is a 4K image well you can see here the image size and when we say view actual size yeah you can see that is actually a lot larger than the full hd screen of the pinebook pro and you can also see that it all looks very nice and sharp so 
that's all for today. Um, still a bit tied up with other projects and that means that I don't have the time and energy to spend at the moment on reviewing some laptops. It's still on my to-do list, but I guess probably after one more month, then I have my hands free to put some more time and effort into reviewing laptops, the ones that I already have. So that's all for today, and I hope to see you again in my next video.